Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. This is Sai Samalyal. Literally shooting this video around 12 o'clock on May 12th in the night. So that means in just another 7 to 8 hours, you'll be watching this video live on YouTube because I'll edit it and keep it live and just go, go to bed. So it's it was a very long day for me. Almost shot almost 5 to 6 videos on YouTube. Edited them like everything is ready. I, I want to create content from now on. I want to get into that because I love doing that. I love helping people. So for all the efforts I'm putting in for all of you guys, do subscribe and support me. And because that subscribe is going to be very like it's free for you but it's going to help me and help my content to reach many other people out there just like you okay chalo talking about this particular video iit 2024 icer aptitude test so it's an exam which you have to give in order to get into icers so you actually you know in order to get into icers there are two two modes so one is iit 2024 and another is je advanced so if you are getting like good percentile in je advanced but it's not a good percentile to get into iit so you can apply icers through that particular je advanced score so with je advanced score there are other colleges also which you can consider in government colleges iip petroleum engineering all, all that will be there that's a different context but talking about this context so if you write iit IAT, IAT, ICER aptitude test based on the score you can apply for counseling and you can get into ICERS. Whoever is very much interested into research doing PhD or like they want to get a doctorate or do want to write, write papers, big publish papers, I mean thesis, right? This is going to be one of the biggest opportunity and best opportunity one, one will get because government have designed these universities mainly to focus on research, research, research. So all the faculty over there, everything is mostly focused on research. So there are almost seven ICERs in India. So namely, I would say Barampur, Bhopal, Kolkata, Mohali, Pune, Tirunathapuram and Tirupati. So in order to apply for this particular exam, today, whatever day you are watching, May 13th, 2024, that is the last date. If the date is extended, I will be updating you on the YouTube channel as well as in my Telegram group. Telegram group link in the description and YouTube channel. Make sure you subscribe, okay? Uh, 16, 17, if you make any mistakes in the application form, you can make corrections. On June 1st, hall tickets will be released. On June 9th, the exam will be conducted. Post that, results will be announced and counseling process will start. So now talking about what are all the seats they offer or what are the programs they offer. They offer uh, like two, two courses mainly. Majority will be dual degree, Bachelor of Science and Master of Science program. Out of 1933 seats, only 115 seats are BS program. That two in only ISR Bhopal. Engineering Sciences and Economic Sciences, 115 seats. Apart from that, remaining all are dual degrees, Bachelor of Science and Master of Science. And you can see key features. Everything is related to research, focused on research. So that's going to be a great opportunity if you want to have the name uh, Dr. So-and-so in front of your name, okay? So, I mean, get the PhD done. Uh, defend your like do research on something defend your phd uh, like research and just get doctorate and do whatever you want like become a scientist go to isro or whatever but depends on whatever field you are working on so after going to isr right not that everyone will get into isro so just after writing this exam it's not only about getting into isr you also have an opportunity to get into isc bangalore and id madras so this is how it is so there is these two programs one is bachelor of science research program in iic bangalore bachelor of science medical sciences and engineering program in iit matters so for these two courses they consider uh, iit score as well so iit based admission into these two courses the process is simple write the exam apply here apply here write the exam get the score you can apply isers here or else it's up to you take that score and with that score you have to apply admissions in iit madras and iic bangalore separately if you want to okay in that case, if your score is good, based on the seat availability and based on the merit, they will give you admission there as well. Okay, and they also have reservations. So, 15% seats will be for SC and uh, uh, like 7.5% seats for ST and 27% for OBC and 10% for EWS and 5% for PWD candidates, just like NITs, IITs, IIITs. Uh, so, the reservation is going to be similar. And coming to fees, how much you have to pay in order to write this exam? 2000 for general EWS, OBC, OBC and CN, SCST, PWD 1000 rupees and if you are foreign national it is 12000 and below they have given details if you get C what you have to pay and what all that that's later on so yeah all this is fine if you want to know how the paper is going to be how the exam is going to be conducted uh, everything question paper pattern so here are the details I'll be leaving all the links in the description check every link in the description so here you will get to find the question paper pattern see the pattern whether 
you can be able to give the exam in another 20 days or not or 20 almost like less than a month 28 days maybe around so then uh, give it a try give it a try and if you crack it you will be into ICERs uh, like focus morely on the research and research okay that's it guys if you find this a time worthy video make sure you like this video and also share with all the people who are interested in doing research in their career so that's it guys see you in the next one until then take care bye bye Jai Hind